Good morning. Today we're out on my porch and I wanted to share with you when I was growing up, I used to watch a TV show called Romper Room. It was like a kindergarten teacher and she had five or six kids that would be a semicircle and she would tell stories and they would do crafts. Um, what I remember most is she had this mirror and it was a little mirror that when she looked through it, it was a hole and not a real mirror and you could see her face and as she was looking through that mirror she began to see people that were out watching tv and she would name all these different names and i remember waiting for my name waiting to hear keith keith and when she said the name keith i knew she was talking about me now, obviously, as I got older, I realized that's not exactly how it worked. But I believe that it's a good way of understanding that God does see each one of us. God doesn't need a mirror, and God is not making some sort of game by just shouting names out. God knows each one of us. God loves each one of us. The scripture I have for today is a couple of verses. It's from 2 Thessalonians chapter 2, verses 16 and 17. Now our Lord Jesus Christ himself and God our Father, who loved us and gave us eternal comfort and good hope through grace, comfort our hearts and establish them in every good work and word. Jesus Christ himself has given us comfort and hope through the love that comes from Jesus so that we could have our hearts comforted. And with our hearts comforted, we are compelled out of joy to work and to speak words of love. The only way to fill our tank when we are tired and exhausted. The only way to look up with a smile and true joy in our hearts is when we connect to God. And Jesus Christ, he calls us by name. He reminds us that we are his children, that he loves us. Let us pray. God, today, open our hearts to hear you call our name. Remind us that you love us. Help us to see the comfort that only you can give so that we are filled with your power to work and to say words of comfort and love to others. In Christ's name we pray. Amen. Have a blessed day.